right guys, welcome back to the shop. Today we're gonna go for a little drive together. What we're gonna do is show you how to properly break in your brake pads. Now this works if you put new brake pads on your vehicle or if you refinish the brake pads as I show in my other video about renewing your brakes, okay? So the first thing you wanna do, vehicles in park obviously, after the brake job, it's get a good hard pedal. Hit the pedal a couple times so you got a nice hard pedal and we're safe to drive. And we can go ahead and go for a drive to a nice open area. And we're gonna start the burnishing in or breaking in process. Now, until then, until we get to that nice open area, you're just gonna wanna drive uh, with light pressure on the brakes whenever you go to stop signs or whatever. Now is a good time while you're going slow to listen for your brakes. You don't want no unusual noises or squeaks or anything like that happening. So when we're at lower speeds, we're safer, let's go ahead and listen for the brakes. So we'll do that and we'll go down the street here and get to the open area. All right, here we go. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is get to a nice open area where you can stop and go as you please. I know it's kinda hard to find, but it's ideal. If you cannot find that, just do something, you know, close to this, I guess you could say, so that we're still breaking them in properly. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get to about 30, 40 miles an hour, you know, moderate speed, and then we're gonna hit the brakes at a moderate pressure on there, and we're not gonna let go of that pressure until the vehicle stops. So we're not going to let up and make a nice smooth stop and all that. We're just going to keep that same moderate pressure on there. So what we're going to do is pull off to the side here because there's a guy behind me. And we're whiffing them to pass. And no one else is coming. Perfect. Okay. And you may have to do this on your own, uh, in your own city there also, your own town. Okay, 30, 40 miles an hour, right? 35, 40. Okay, moderate pressure. Okay. Don't ever change it. All the way until you actually stop. Okay, we're going to repeat this three, four, five times until you have the pedal where it feels normal again. Okay. Now, once you do that three, four, five times, whatever it takes to get that pedal feeling right where the surfaces are mating and they're gripping and that coefficient of friction is there. What you're gonna wanna do after that is drive up to 55, 65 miles an hour, higher speeds, and do the same exact process. Okay, so we'll get up to speed here. Gotta get this little four cylinder going. Okay, 60, perfect. Same thing, no one behind us. Moderate pressure. All the way until you stop. Okay? And do that same thing four or five times. Okay? Now, after that, you're gonna wanna let the brakes cool down. No more of this constant stopping for no reason and stuff, okay? So then we're gonna drive normal. We're gonna drive normal you come around a curve you slow down you come to a stop sign you slow down like normal okay and then you'd be able to evaluate the brakes that's the initial break-in it's still gonna take a couple hundred miles to you know finish the break-in but this is a good initial break-in so that the the vehicle stops properly and is safe for you and your family I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this kind of video and these kinds of uh, repair videos on Fords, go ahead and hit like and subscribe down below. And I'll have a lot more content out in the future. And of course, there's a huge library already of almost 600 videos for you guys uh, that own Ford vehicles. See you next time.